special from the time we met. We immediately became best friends and our relationship only grew from there. From school dances to birthday parties, we were always each other's go-to as a date. As time passed, we realized we weren't only best friends, but soulmates. During the best times of my life, you were with me always, but I truly realized you were the one for me through the hardest time of my life. An accident that should have killed me brought me more peace and understanding than I thought was possible. With you by my side and God in our corner, I knew that we were together for a reason. God knows the plans He has for us, plans to prosper us and not to harm us, plans to give us hope and a future. I hold on to the hope He gives me of a future with you, and it is finally here. Through the recovery process from the accident, I realized that I truly love everything that made you Alexis. You are the most headstrong person I know. Your work ethic is inspiring. Your sense of intuition is a blessing and I will spend the rest of my life trying to be as thoughtful, kind, and compassionate as you are to me. I would not be where I am today or who I am today without you by my side. You're the one I want to grow old with, and I love you always, Princess. waiting for this day with you for as long as I can remember. Albeit, I cannot tell you the exact moment, but somewhere between us riding to school together, going to proms, and taking you on all the family trips, I knew that you would be the one I would spend the rest of my life with. Through all these years that we have spent together, I have fallen in love with you over and over. Your positive outlook on life and faith in God is inspiring. When your accident happened and I felt that it would flip our world upside down, you constantly reminded me that it's all part of God's plan and everything in life is for a reason. You're my best friend, my rock. You complete me and encourage me. You have the kindest heart. 
you're my sanity when I'm in need of a plan and there isn't one. You are fearless and determined. Your sense of humor and eye-rolling jokes have, a, have the ability to make me laugh no matter the mood I'm in. You love me wholeheartedly, wholeheartedly and without judgment. There is not a day that passes that I don't feel loved by you. On this day, I vow to love you exactly as you are, unconditionally, in the good times and the bad. I vow to share your dreams and support you as you strive to achieve your goals. I will allow you to add all the spices to the things we cook. I vow to be the wife God has called me to be, to pray with you, and to go with you wherever he may lead us. Side by side, hand in hand, I will go with you anywhere, because you're home to me. I vow to build a home with you that is filled with laughter, love, and many trips to Disney. I vow to cherish our marriage and remain faithful to you in all the days of our lives. I cannot wait to begin this journey of life with you. Hayden Simmons, you're my happily ever after. I love you. It's been a joy and an honor to be here with this couple today and have the ability as a minister and the authority that's been given to me as a minister, the Church of God, I declare that Hayden and Alexis are now husband and wife. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. Whom God is joined together, let no man put asunder. Hayden, you may have already done this, but you can do it again. You may kiss your bride. <laughs> It is my great honor and privilege to be the first to present to you Mr. and Mrs. Hayden Simmons. <laughs>